I'm meteorologist Eric Bray. Thank you for checking us out at click2houston.com for your weather forecast as we head into the work week, into spring break week. That gets going full swing as we head into Monday. Lots of kids looking for things to do, and I think the weather is going to hold out nicely for parents who want to get their kids outside, burn a little energy. You're going to have lots of options. Cloudy skies for your Sunday, but uh, things really do change as we head into Monday. This is the way we see it. Around Texas, we've got very quiet weather. The rain from uh, earlier this weekend, Saturday, is well offshore, and it stays offshore. Looking at the bigger picture, Texas stays pretty dry. We've got low pressure in the Midwest. We've got low pressure developing along the Atlantic coast. Notice all the rain in the Gulf of Mexico stretching up into the uh, mid-Atlantic states. Well, low pressure is going to get going. Those two areas of low pressure are going to merge right up the east coast as a pretty bad nor'easter. It looks like things uh, uh, will depend really on the track of this low. If it stays offshore more, it's going to be more of a snow event. If it stays closer to shore, it may be more of a rain event for the immediate coast. But certainly, it's going to be a national story come Tuesday and possibly into Wednesday with several inches of rain for portions of the Northeast. In the meantime, they deal with winter weather. We've got high pressure. We've got sunshine taking us through midweek. It's going to be pretty nice around Texas as we start this week. Only small chances for rain. We'll show you that in the 10 day forecast here coming up. But the thing you need to know for tonight, if you're heading out and about, temperatures are going to be in the 50s, dropping slowly. We've got cloud cover, so that tends to insulate us a little bit, keeps our temperatures buoyed so they don't drop as much after the sun goes down. But by 7 o'clock in the morning tomorrow, we're looking at high or at low temperatures right near 50 degrees. Some places north, well west of town, could see temperatures drop into the upper 40s. But here's what happens uh, a little bit different than your Sunday. We've got clouds to start the day on Monday, but the clouds clear out. Temperatures rebound nicely with the help of a little sunshine, and we should break 70 degrees. A very seasonable day, really a very lovely day coming up. Uh, temperatures in the mid 60s by Monday evening. It might be a nice night to take a dinner out on a patio somewhere, your own patio at a restaurant, wherever you choose. The chain smokers this evening at the rodeo temperatures 57 degrees at 7 p.m., 56 at 9, 55 at 11. And here is the extended forecast. We're going to hold on to that sunshine through Wednesday. Do enjoy it. Low temperatures in the morning, a little on the cool side, 40s to low 50s. So you'll need the jackets in the morning, but you can shed them. As you head toward the afternoon with that sunshine, it does warm us up nicely. And then more clouds, more humidity. We see a bit of a return flow on the Gulf of Mexico, so it's going to feel a little bit more humid. 20% chance for rain Thursday, Friday, Saturday. We're not looking at any major uh, weather systems coming through here, so most of us are going to stay dry. A lot of us not see any rain Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Can't rule it out, though, so we'll leave a 20% chance. In. And then we dry out second half of the weekend. Temperatures in the low 80s. Spring officially starts a week from Monday at that 529 in the morning and we are looking at a pretty nice start to the week next week once the kids do go back to school. But again, uh, spring break week is shaping up to be pretty nice. And yes, of course, in the middle of spring break week toward the end of spring break week, we've got St. Patrick's Day on Friday. A lot of you probably planning your activities and the weather should cooperate. That is your 10 day forecast. Thank you once again for checking us out at click2houston.com. Do have a great evening.